Pneumonia Recovery House. And from my understanding, there's two locations. Well, maybe three, actually. I'm pretty sure there's a house, which is what I'm at now. There's a penthouse location, and there's like an apartment location also. Last time I was here, I stayed at the penthouse. It was literally sky high rise. Um, we were on like the 12th or 14th floor, I'll say. I liked it there just because it was very quaint. There was only a few girls there at a time, but um, here is perfectly fine too. Everybody's nice. The staff is super nice. Um, right now, I'm just kind of out in like the little courtyard area. There's a few places that you can sit, so I'm just going to give you guys a really quick tour. If you do decide to stay at Armonia, this is what you will get. I have a private room, um, however, <laughs> they gave me a discount because it's like the smaller private room and um, honestly it reminds me of jail a little bit. <laughs> like I think jail cells are bigger than this, but I'm by myself so it's fine. Um, you do have to get buzzed in at the gate right here, so that's always great. And then there's also another gate where the car... You have to get buzzed in there too so like i said um, i'm just going to give you guys a tour really quick of like i said if you decide to come here this is what you will get forgot this video was in my phone <laughs> so I have been back from surgery now for like five or six months so we'll just say I'm like five and a half months post-op right I got surgery in February when I went it was literally the perfect time I don't know if it was because it was around tax season or because people hadn't really like gotten their taxes yet or maybe it's just because the weather was cooler in the states um, there was nobody at CEPLA, the surgery clinic. There was also no one at the recovery house. I mean, when I first got there, I only saw maybe other, like, two other girls or so. By the time I left, maybe there was, like, five or six people. But I was on the top floor, like, 
well, I don't even want to say the top floor. I was on floor two. <laughs> so um, there were other girls downstairs, um, but it was literally like a, like one person per room. So, I mean, unless we were actually in like the living room or the kitchen or like just kind of co-mingling with each other, like we weren't we weren't running into each other, which was great, especially if you like your privacy. Um, what else can I say about Armonia? I believe I was there for like 10 or 11 days. I'm sorry, like I said, it's been a minute now and I don't fully remember. <laughs> um, I think I was there for 10 days and I wanna say it was $1,100 and that was for everything. And when I say everything, like recovery houses, they do your laundry. They cook you three meals a day, they change your sheets, they help you bathe, they do like your faha and everything for you after you get surgery. Um, what else do they do? Oh, and that also included my massages. Now I know each doctor was kind of different. Um, I guess my doctor, Dr. Soto, <laughs> had a, um, he had like a, a deal with, one, with Armonia. It was like one of the preferred recovery homes, we'll say. So, <clears throat> my massages came in the package with the recovery house which was great so i didn't have to worry about like you know finding a masseuse or anything like that now there was a massage like an actual massage room in armonia um like i said because my doctor had a deal with them i just went into the massage room other doctors had like a masseuse come to the house and they would do your massages in the room so depending on like what doctor you have depends on like how your massage package is um what else the food was fine i mean it's only gonna be but so good <laughs> towards the end i was kind of like eh, uber eats uber eats uber eats like i just i couldn't do grilled chicken and rice anymore but you know you just had surgery so they cook everything very bland minimal seasoning minimal excitement <laughs> they don't want you to swell they don't want you to have extra sodium like you know it's not needed because when you swell it's painful and then your massages are even more painful because they're trying to work all that fluid out of your body um what else the nurses they checked up on us often and i don't know if it's because there was only a couple girls there so they were kind of like i'll say bored um but they were constantly in rotation it could kind of be a little bit annoying just because it's like, you know, I'm trying to watch this, I'm trying to watch that. But at the same time, like they are doing their job. They're checking up on you, seeing if you need anything. Um, oh, they, they administer your meds and all that too. So that's, you know, you don't have to, you don't have to like consciously <laughs> make note of like what you're supposed to take when because they're really like on top of it. Um, what else can I tell you guys about Armonia? Overall, I mean, it was a fine experience if you decide to stay there. Um, you'll get three meals a day, snacks, fresh laundry, and <laughs> they will be very attentive to you. Like I said, too, if you can go like towards the beginning of the year, January, February or so, probably even March, um, I don't think there will be anybody there. If you have any questions about Armonia or just anything surgery related please feel free drop comments in the de in the description box up uh, drop comments below <laughs> and i should be making a part two video i know i say this all the time and then months later here we are it's just coming out <laughs> but i should be making a uh, part two video i'm going to give you guys a tour of the clinic cepla like i said there was nobody there it was Odd. I walked from the front door all the way up to the doctor's office and did not run into a single person. Um, I'll just give you a tour of the whole setup. And I will also be doing a Q&A of the most common questions I get regarding surgery. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vid and until next time, bye.